Hi my peeps, what's up Wagwan? Welcome back to your girl Tier 9 in the house. Please remember to leave me a little like and subscribe for other amazing content coming your way. Now guys, you know I'm the Irish Mars Sea Mars Queen and guys I'm gonna boil some Irish Marsh or Sea Moss. Jamaican style, Jamaican vibes. Right, that's all. Alright. And guys, I'm going to do it a different way today, but after I will tell you. I'm going to add some ginger and some lemon. Going to give it the flavor, going to be spicy and delicious. Alright guys, so now we're going to soak the sea mass, our Irish mash. You want to soak out all the salt in it, alright? So it become clean and fresh and nice, okay? So I add one package in it and I'm going to use two. So you want to go ahead, come on. <laughs> Alright, guys, can you see all those salt in it? Alright, first you want to wash it. So we're going to give it the first wash. And you want to wash it a few times well and we're gonna wash it a second time and you can wash it three four times guys it doesn't matter you can wash it as many times as you like all right but two times is good enough the room temperature water is good enough all right now I'm gonna cover these Irish marsh or sea moss and then I'm gonna soak them for overnight all right That's good enough guys, all right? You can leave it out on the counter or you can put it in the fridge. It's up to you. You wanna soak it for overnight as I said and you'll see everything rise up. Yeah, them fresh and nice and the water still clean. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna strain this off. I'm gonna give it another rinse so it's fresh and clean. That's it. When you have it clean and nice like this, I use two pack, remember? So two packs and I'm gonna put eight cups of water. So this is four. And this is four. Eight cups. Basically, when everything boil down, you're supposed to get about four cup, or say three and a half. I'm gonna turn my stove on, and I'm gonna do it a different way today. Here I have some lemon slice and some fresh cut ginger. We're gonna pour everything in it. All right, so you know say guys, right here so. Pack with antioxidants, lots of health benefits. And guys, you know, Irish marsh, good for your health, good to, to boost and build your immune system. Help to fight cancer, diabetes, high blood pressure, pack with lots of fiber. Lots of vitamins, yeah. You're gonna build your body and you're gonna clean you out, all right? So guys, another thing. If you want, you can take a spoonful now and again or you can put it in your punch or your smoothie or you can just make some Irish mash drink as is, all right? So you can use it on your face, you can put it in your hair, all right? So this is Tiona's way of making Irish mash gel authentic and original all right so once the ginger start to boil out in this mm, you know say the ginger flavor combined with the lemon mm, good for flu and cold yeah yeah all of this good for pain and all inflammation so yeah yeah so this is my way of boiling it and also you still can put it in your smoothie and you can use it in your punch this is just gonna flavor up your Irish mash because the Irish mash don't really have no taste you know it does bland I show you in previous video I will leave a link how to make it as well in the other way 
you want to put some um, cinnamon stick and all of that in it all right guys you can even put some mint leaves too depends on how you want to flavor it up some time ago i use um flaxseed and irish marsh really good all right but i'm just gonna make this plain today but the next episode i'm gonna make irish marsh and bladder rack and i'll show you how that is done okay so right here guys without further long talking come you realize me i talk too much i'm gonna let this come to a boil smells good already all right and once you see start to bubble look there guys everything that soft up and all of that look at that some people go ahead and blend it raw but guys you have to have a really really good strong blender it's gonna mash up but doing it like this same thing Ooh. so you want to watch it all right guys don't turn up the stove too high all right turn down it make sure it's still like 2.4 so it can take time and boil because i don't want it to boil over all right i'm gonna let this boil right down and then i'll come back Ooh, almost boil out guys look there a little bit left all right so we're gonna give this about say 10 more minutes 10 15 more minutes everything should be good and then we're gonna strain it all right no rush just let it boil down I'm gonna turn it off now Oof. I'm gonna let it cool down and then I'm gonna strain it this is it it cooled down somewhat so I'm gonna throw it out can you see the goodness there guys you want to strain everything all right look at that goodness guys so basically you just wanna mix it All right, I'm gonna finish all of this and then I'm gonna come back. And that's what left in my strainer. I'm gonna pour it out. Can you see the goodness here, guys? yes i get another jar again <laughs> every time i make it guys i keep getting this same jar yes yes good measurement <laughs> all right guys can you see how thick it is yes it's gonna get even firmer all right so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna cover it put it in the fridge and then i'm gonna come back maybe later or tomorrow i'll show you how firm up it be all right ready to go ready to use all right guys that's it bird chirping so beautiful in the morning here So this is a new way of making Irish marsh sea moss gel. I love hearing the bird chirping. Wow, so peaceful. Can you see that guys? And I'm gonna eat this spoon just as it is half spoon. Oh my, this tastes nice and flavored with the ginger and the lemon. Oh, yes, guys, yes. Wow. Mm, mm. 
so delicious and refreshing healthy as well all right guys love upon me and i love upon you mm, you have a wonderful day